Welcome to Ecom Russian Monthly Video Cast. In these video casts, we'll discuss cultural and seasonal topics of Russia. So whether you're studying the language or just interested in the culture, we hope you'll enjoy the series. I'll be your host, Heather. And I'm your co-host, Elena. Is everyone ready? Давайте начнем! All right, Elena, it's May and it's warming up and everybody's enjoying being outside. Right, yeah, in Moscow too, it's warmer now. Okay, so what are people up to these days in Moscow? Well, uh, on May 9th, there is a famous parade. It happens on Victory Day. Okay. May 9th is a Victory Day, um, which is celebrated every year in Russia. And it's a holiday, national holiday. And on this day, you can see the military parade. So all the Russian army forces uh, make a big show on the Red Square. So for mm -hmm. those who are interested in Russian history or like to know more about Russian army and military, that's the time to visit Moscow. I see. And you said it's called a Victory Day or a Victory Parade. What victory is... Day. And on that day, the parade goes on. Okay. Um, and what is it, Victory? What are you celebrating? The Victory? Uh, World War II. Oh, the World War II. Okay, yeah. I see. And um, have you ever been to the parade? Oh, yeah, definitely. Even when I was a kid, I remember seeing it. And yeah, okay. I like it. I think it's fascinating. Yeah. Mm. My favorite part is the Air Force show. Like, oh. I really like to watch the airplanes over the Red Square with the fireworks. Wow. Yeah, it's really looks uh, exciting. They do different tricks, like they turn around mm. and they show all the new technolo technology mm. available. Yeah. I see. Mm. And uh, is this a parade that's televised on, like, across Russia on TV? Oh, yeah. Yes. Oh. Everybody watches it, I guess. Yeah. Wow, very mm. interesting. I see. Thank you very much. Mm. You're welcome. So, Elena, you just talked about, you know, the military parade on right. Victory Day and everything yeah. like that. Um, so are guns a big part of Russian culture? I know like in the movies you always see Russian roulette and things like that, but is it really Russian? The, well, Russian roulette is really Russian. Yeah, it originated maybe even before the revolution. Okay. And it has quite a sad uh, maybe... Origin. Origin, mm. right. So originally this game was played by guards in prisons and they would give a gun to the prisoners uh -huh. and bet money on who's going to die so they put one bullet and then they spin their chamber mm -hmm. and one by one the prisoners have to put it to the head and i click. see <laughs> yeah i mm. see and yeah. Was this legal or? Of course not. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, it was not legal. But okay. what we do in Russia now, we actually play it with alcohol. Oh, okay. Yeah, so what you can do is maybe with your friends mm -hmm. at a party, you put some vodka and tomato juice in little shot glasses uh -huh. and put Tabasco, lots <gasps> of Tabasco in one, and then you mix the glasses and I everybody has see. to drink and one person will be... Like, would drink something very, very spicy and his face will turn red. Yeah, that would be really funny. So, so that's a modern Russian roulette. <laughs> that sounds really fun. Is that a, um, very typical? Is that just you and your friends or that's a actually uh, no, nationwide? I, I think a lot of Russians do that, actually. Yeah. yeah. I see. Mm, it's oh. a way to have fun at a party. Mm. It does sound fun. I'd like mm, to try. try that, yeah. <laughs> I hope you won't get the Tabasco one. Yeah, I think yeah. the uh, the drinking Russian roulette definitely... Uh, a, a bit it? safer and mm. more fun. <laughs> right, it is. Mm. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. So today we talked about military parade and Russian roulette. Ruska ruletka. I won't try that one. <laughs> All right, everyone. I hope you enjoyed today's video cast. Keep on studying and we'll see you next time. До свидания.